Testing, testing. One, two, three, four. Testing, testing. Is this thing on? Is this thing even on? <laughs> I'm gonna. You guys, before I begin this video, I want to say thank you so much to all of our new subscribers from Dawn's channel, from Money Mon's channel. You guys are the best. Thank you so much. We're so close to 1,000 subscribers, and I appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart. Um, what I will do to my viewers, I've mentioned Money Mom's channel before, but I'm going to link her again in the description box when I was trying to pay off all of that debt. Her channel was one of, was one of the channels that really helped me like get through that entire process. So yeah, please check her out. Everything financial, but she's also on her weight loss journey. So go over and give her some support and cheer her on too. Let's do this. Come on, Don. Let's do it. Hey guys, it's Felicia with Happily Ever After Living. Welcome to week five of my 12 week transformation and also week two of my intermittent fasting journey. So this will be a quick video. I just needed to do a quick check-in to share with you guys this week's weigh-in. So as you guys know, I was away last week on a seven day, six night cruise. I'll link that video up here. And I ate to my heart's desire. Oh my gosh, I ate so much food. Ah, it was such a good time, but I really just wanted to enjoy myself. I wanted to celebrate and not be so concerned about like, good food, bad food. Like I'm just trying to get rid of all of that stuff completely, all those terms completely. So anyways, you guys saw I was fairly active. Um, so I wanna share with you the numbers for this week's weigh in. But before we do that, let's go into my office because I need to chat with you guys about something else real quick. I just need to address a viewer's concern and then we'll come back and talk about the weigh in. Hey guys, so it's Felicia from the future. And I just wanted to address a viewer's concern on my previous video when I first did started intermittent fasting on this journey and I lost like 6.6 .6 pounds and the only reason why I'm addressing it is because I definitely feel that it was out of concern like I don't think it was like a negative well I'm not interpreting it as like a negative comment I think it was just one out of genuine concern and her concern was that I'm like starving myself and that's the reason why I lost weight I totally get it I understand because prior to me started intermittent fasting myself, I probably would have had the same thoughts, same concerns or whatever. But I just wanted to share with you guys, as you saw in my last video when I was on the cruise vacation, I'm definitely not starving myself. And I just wanted to share, um, I wrote down like four reasons as to why I definitely like would not do that. Um, number one is I'm old enough, I'm 41 years old, so I'm old enough to know that starving yourself does not work like that is not a long-term solution and i know that some people are new to the channel so i've been you know like on this weight loss thing for quite some time and i am at the point in my life like where i'm looking for a long-term solution i'm not doing quick diets i'm not doing i'm not looking for the overnight success you guys have heard me say it before i'm truly trying to heal my body so yes, I would not like starve myself because I'm just old enough to know that that doesn't work. And then number two, you guys know I'm a lifestyle coach and a physical therapist. And even though I'm not your healthcare provider, I do take on this ethical responsibility to where I would not knowingly like share information that I feel would hurt anyone, my viewers. I mean, some of my family members watch the channel. so like. I will not share something that would hurt my family or hurt you guys, like my friends, you know? So there's, I just, I wouldn't do that. I'm, I'm not that person and I'm not promoting starvation. I'm not promoting any type of eating disorders or any of that stuff. You guys, there's a ton of research out on intermittent fasting. I'm just sharing with you my experience, but the, the information and the knowledge is there if you choose to um, seek it out. Um. And then number three, I enjoy food. <laughs> I enjoy food so much. I enjoy, I enjoy shopping for food, which is why I share with you guys here on the channel. I enjoy prepping food. I enjoy the smells, the aromas. I enjoy trying new foods. I enjoy like different cultures or ethnicities of food. I enjoy, like there's just so many things about food that I truly enjoy. So you don't have to worry about me like starving myself because I just enjoy food way too much, which leads us to number four. 
I did not get to 260 pounds by starving myself. And I'm gonna say something, and I'm not like making light of people that truly do have eating disorders, like bulimia or anorexia. I'm, this is not, I'm not making fun of. But if I had the power to starve myself, <laughs> I would have never made it to 260 pounds. I would have done that a long time ago. <laughs> I would have done it way before I got to 260. I don't have the ability. I like I don't have that. I my hunger signal is in full attack. Like the thing is working and it goes off and it reminds me, yep, Felicia, we need to eat. <laughs> So I just wanted to address that in case any of you guys had concerns because I know that this is a community where we're trying to build each other up. There are a lot of us that are on weight loss, health, fitness journeys, and I just want this to be a community, a community in which we can continue to build each other up and support each other. So if any of you guys have those concerns, trust me, I am not starving myself. I eat a lot <laughs> and I try to eat very well. I try to eat food that is nutritionally dense. Lots of veggies, fruit, all the things. So yeah, let's go back to this week's weigh-in. All right, so now that we're back and we've gotten that out of the way, and again, I do appreciate the concern, but I did want to address it, given the fact that I am a healthcare professional. Um, so last week, you guys, I weighed in at 225.8, and I am so happy, yes, happy! I am so happy to announce that this week, I'll put the weigh-in here. I weighed in at 224.6. So your girl lost 1.2 pounds. That is freaking incredible. Oh my gosh. That is so exciting. Like, <sighs> I am just so excited that I was able to go away on vacation and just really enjoy myself and not gain weight, first of all. And I'm so happy that I didn't use the cruise as like an excuse to like eat my money's worth and all of that stuff. All of those old mindsets that I had before. Like I'm just so happy that I had a good time. I ate all the food that I wanted to eat. You guys saw, if you haven't, again, I'll link that video. I just really had a great time. But let's do some quick body shots. Right, guys I'm a little too hyped yeah but I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget to like share and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video bye guys <laughs>